hi another Korean um, haul video uh, plus review from my last uh, Korean uh, cosmetics products review and because I've been using it for a while so whether or not I will repurchase or something okay um, first this is a new product that I just purchased same brand as the last one the Sorehan this is um, the pomegranate concentrate essence so before I shake it all oh, already you can see the the red color is the pomegranate and underneath is the essence of something so you just shake it I have been using a uh, retin a for about um, three night but the doses um, I'm in is very mild it's just 0 0.025 it's very hard for me to get retin a the first time I try I used retin a was about um, almost I think five years ago for five years ago is when I have um, skin problem <laughs> I've talked about the retin A uh, on another video about retin A experience but now back to this so I wash my face and you can see it's um, rough um, oh now I'm going to apply this the shape well nice color I have my brow today <laughs> so the the video will not I will not look so terrible <laughs> at the first you might feel this uh, oily but after a while it's all been absorbed absorbed by my skin into my skin I use this as a, as a toner myself. Because uh, pomegranate is uh, an anti-aging product. So let me see. This is 200 plus. It's not the very expensive products. And I have bought some uh, the who history of who this is um, a sample pack and this will be the the product we will look like but the history of who is only SPF 25 PA plus plus And the Sorehan uh, color control cream is uh, oh same 28 28 PA plus plus I'm going to open this it's hard Okay, it has a light color. Even though you can see this a tiny little product. You really need a very little amount though.
just a, a size of a rice and that rice here when you spread out Uh, the guy told me that I, uh, the difference between the BB cream uh, or and the CC cream, like as a Korean standard, okay, is the CC cream is more brighter looking, like it's a skin brightener. So it's it's not like uh, BB cream. BB cream, you can see the color is a little bit dull or matte looking. And this one is not even though I got a very bad skin conditions uh, my skin start peeling around this area um, just how little I have squeeze it out And I think it's buildable if you like uh, milk coverage. Okay, the other half of my face, I'm going to use this. Even here, I can see because my pores here is quite large. And on this side, So far, so good. And this one is very funny. Um, and you squeeze it out, is in white. So this is the amount I will start with. Not not much also. This is even more brighter than this. The texture is different. This one is like is moist uh, feeling, but this one has tiny little bit oil on it. But uh, but not oily at all. <laughs> is a program that remind me to for drink of drinking remind me for drinking water <laughs> so I think for um, the history of who is more natural looking This one is a little bit, uh, the the way it's brighter, brightening is a little bit uh, off-white, but this one is more natural. Even though my neck haven't put anything yet, you can see. Uh, this is a Jensen. Red Jensen oil, and just like the uh, Lancome serum, when you open it, uh, oh, no, when you close, these things already here. See, already pre-pumped for you, and this is also for. Uh, facial uh, and you can apply for anywhere oh too much this is on 
also a couple hundred uh, Hong Kong dollars and 30 mil very strong ginseng smell very strong ginseng smell uh, because they said uh, even though you use it on the joint will help um, your joint uh, softening if you have joint problems I don't know I, I give it a try because my arms here has a uh, problem for a year now I can't lift my hands <laughs> this is no problem but this side <laughs> this is all I can already feel the pain over here is my look very oily now but after a while my skin will be absorbing absorb all of it okay so just to let you know they have some product like this and I have bought the uh, history of who this is the brightening cleansing form when you buy the big one this is 180 mil is a very big product I haven't tried yet so I don't know how how, how this works and it's come with the travel size this is 40 mil as a gift and this this products only uh, the full size is only 100 plus I'm talking about Hong Kong dollars okay and I also uh, got some backup for the uh, uh, whitening complex cream and <laughs> I bought some uh, nail colors this is a very cheap product is it 20 something or 30 dollars Hong Kong so a set of whole set is come with three colors three tones got the base got the shimmer so I don't know how it's turned out yet uh, an orange color something to play with and I got the mascara So far, they said it's very popular in Korea. And I have to open it up first. The brush has, but the brush had just the brush, blech, the brush had just like the, um, oh, they have the instruction telling you. teach you how to use and then we will not have this problem can remove it with water magic curling okay give it a try later and another product is I want to do this is an, another pack I have bought and I have bought uh, the full size of this uh, this one I highly recommend uh, this with the difference between this brand and the other the the Roy uh, in Cantonese is Loi uh, the Loi I have tried uh, different line like the different color like uh, for volumizing or for oily scalp or for perm hair color hair nutrition but I don't really uh, feel the difference in between all those shampoo even those they they said uh, they claim is in 
they have different uh, use for this I have bought this the purple color it may not show as purple because on the screen this look like blue bluish it's purple even this is purple packing purple uh, and I have also bought the uh, the red color so called the red color is for volumizing I found after oh this shampoo is fermented ginseng they use uh, ginseng and they fermented it so it's different than the loy and this has no ginseng smell at all so the red one of this brand the volumizing I can feel this after you wash is volumized a bit because uh, your hair will feel like have a coating on it which make your hair a little bit like uh, thicker it's had that effect but with Loi I don't feel the, the effect at all just like very clean if you like the very clean uh, feelings go to that line and you don't mind about the ginseng smell and this is for um, oily scalp and have um, have a scalp problems go for this purple line um, I found that since I have very oily scalp and dry hair so before I'm using this I have to wash my hair daily and I even though how hard I try like today if I wash my hair in the morning at night if I don't wash my hair I can't sleep <laughs> how oily it is and if I put my finger in when I take it out I can see the oil already all over my hands now you can see I have a little bit oil on my hands because it's been two days yeah two days that I have I didn't wash my hair you can see it's not from my video my root is not as oily as my last video so this works very nicely uh, so I don't have to wash my hair every day because especially if your hair is dry but oily scalp this really helps because um, dry hair shouldn't wash all the time but with the humid weather you can't stand the oiliness and I can't stand the smell because every time if I put my hands on it and then when I turn oh, okay you can see I, now it's clean fingers So it's not too bad. This is what I, I can af accept. Not much. Just tiny little bit because it's been two days. And I've been sick for I've been sick for about three, four days. Normally if I sleep for a longer time, my scalp is more even more oily if you stay on bed. Mm. So this is my whole and product review oh this <clears throat> and also one more thing I bought another brush it's very very soft but I don't know how how well it's worked yet let's see but the the last um, brush I have bought um, uh, is very soft it's look like you can use it as a buffer 
it's still very soft it's look like a buffer bo uh, buffer brush but it's not uh, I might use it as uh, before he told me that it, this is for foundation if I use it last time when I use it on um, liquid foundations it just work like a normal foundation brush like you have to apply it like this and you can't buff with it it doesn't work that way it's too soft and it got wet it is not working that way so I found another way to work with this brush <coughs> so back to the uh, mascara It's a mixed brush, Givenchy plus the other. Smell okay, not strong. It's not really curling my lashes comparing with uh, my other mascara products. Okay, I'm trying to use another brand to compare. I'm using the Paul and Joe. Um, I think I prefer the uh, Ho and Joe, one of my favorite uh, mascara. This is waterproof and almost like the oil proof also because the way my my eyes close the mascara will just uh, melt and stay under my eyes here my point just stay very very good and it's not easy to remove <laughs> but with the with this it's no problem okay very nice if you don't like and also you don't have even though you apply two layers, you don't feel that your mus uh, your lashes is very heavy. It's very light. I finished my makeup with the old uh, palette, the Luna Soul. This is a navy blue. Which is very close to the Guerlain uh, new palette. Okay, thank you again. Bye.